Okay guys, in today's video, I will show you how to find magnetic variation in this type of ECDIS. This is Puruno FMD3200. So first, you need to find this variation symbol. If you cannot find it, you may zoom in and zoom out the screen until this one will appear. Or you can uh, uh, visit or check the menu if the magnetic variation is enabled. Okay, you go to menu. Then click chart display. Then click other. Okay. This one, magnetic variation. If you're going to uncheck this one, and you save the, if you click the save, you will see that the uh, variation symbol will disappear. Okay. If you're going to check magnetic variation, and click save, symbol will appear. Okay, there you go. Okay. Okay, now put the cursor on the top of the symbol. Then right click of the mouse. Then click pick report. Then this dialog box will appear. Click this magnetic variation. Then click select. Okay, you have here the attributes. Okay, let us see what is the variation in this area. So the value of magnetic variation is... 2 degrees. If you cannot see any negative here, it means this is east. If there is a negative, it means this is west. Then, you have to check the reference year of magnetic variation. So, this is 2020. Then, you have to check also the value of annual change in magnetic variation. This is 7 minutes east. There is no negative here. So, this me it means this is is so if you're going to write it down your variation for the year 2020 would be two degrees is the year is 2020 and the annual change is seven minutes is so this year is 2024 so all we have to do is we need to deduct 2024 this is the present year subtract to 2020 so we have four years so the annual change is 7 minutes this is the annual change so we have this is multiply so we have 28 minutes we need to divide this one into 60 to make it decimal so we have 0 0.5 so we have 2 degrees is then we have 0 0.5 is so the variation for the current year 2024 is 2.5 is so if it is same name we you need to add okay same name add different name minus okay so this is same name it means this is increasing so we need to add if this is a different name then this is decreasing so we need to uh, subtract then if this is different name the sign of the variation would be based on the bigger number okay so, hope guys, uh, you learned something from this video. Thank you.